Man from Old Saybrook is facing charges after crashing his car into a house. It happened in Westbrook. News H's Brian Spiros has details. A portion of Route 1 had to be closed in Westbrook so crews could extinguish the flames that erupted at this home. It all started with a man behind the wheel of a car. Police say 23 year old Rodrigo Sousa of Old Saybrook veered off the road. His car then crashed into the house and ruptured a gas line, which started the fire. The car was fully involved. Flames were going up the side of the house and into the attic. Um, we, we have saved the structure, it, it's still standing. Um, we were able to. Uh, Put the fire out. But it was no easy task. That ruptured gas line kept throwing flames until the utility company arrived to shut it off. The car was completely charred. The driver was not in the vehicle when we arrived. Um, he was, uh, I believe, walking around on scenes. A neighbor captured this video shortly after the crash and shared it with News 8. In it, you can see Sousa going through a sobriety test. He was then arrested. As this was happening, firefighters were trying to deal with the cold temperatures and all the freezing water. Right now, Route 1, where we're working, is obviously solid ice. We do have DOT on standby waiting to come out and sand. The home that was hit along Boston Post Road was vacant. No one lived there. Reporting from Westbrook, Brian Spiros, News 8.